What's up guys and welcome to a gameplay commentary of Ace of Spades. Now this is sort of more of a gameplay commentary. It's sort of my complete idea of the game. Showing some gameplay with it though, this is live commentary. You know, if you guys like this, I'll probably show off more of it depending on if you like this video or not. But Ace of Spades, my, made by a producer named Jagex. Sounds familiar? They made RuneScape. <laughs> you know, a pretty um, big game if you were a fan of MMOs back in the day. You know, the game's still around, but... I don't know anyone who plays it. <laughs> Maybe back in like the fifth grade, but Ace of Spades. Um, probably all came from this home screen here. You probably see a very big familiarity of Minecraft and Team Fortress 2. Those are the two big bases of the game. And now as you see here, there are plenty of servers to join. They are all loading up. And there's several different game modes. I've been really getting myself sucked up in this game. It sells normally for about 10 bucks on Steam. I feel like $5 is its real price range, and that's what I bought it for during the Steam Christmas sale or whatever. And I say look for it on $5, and unless you really, really want the game, then get it for um the $10, but I really feel like it's not nothing more worth than $5 because there's nothing really original in the game. It just mixes a bunch of original concepts. Now let's go and find a um, server here. Let me just do this one. This one is Team Deathmatch. Team Deathmatch is pretty simple. You just need to kill the team, other team, you know, and get more kills than they do by the end of the time. Okay, so once the server is up, you just join whatever team you want. I'm going to join Blue and pick Marksman. This is the sniper class. They have four classes. I'll explain the classes if you guys want to see more of this game. If you guys are truly interested, I will show that to you guys. Now, one of the greatest things about this game is that you can destruct anything in the map. Everything is up to you. And it doesn't completely run by Minecraft physics. Saying, like, if I got rid of all these pillars, it won't float. It'll actually fall and just demolish. And that's a really amazing factor. This means that the map is completely game-changing. I've, se I've seen games where people just completely destroy the map, and they, um... You know, they win because of that. Like, they, they destroy the enemy's base, and it's pretty awesome. But obviously, you need a good team cooperation for that kind of stuff. So, if you haven't noticed, yes, it really obviously just takes concepts of Minecraft and TF2 and just mashes it into one game. That's why it's just a fun little $5 game to play. It's just sort of like, oh, I'm bored, why don't I play this little game for about 10, 15 minutes just to get some, um... Some, you know, just time wasted. Oh, I need to shoot this guy. Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Oh, jeez, no. Did I get him? Oh, no, I didn't. Oh, no. Oh, no. What's happening? Reloading. Oh, I'm dead. I'm dead. Oh, no. Oh, no. I'm not that bad at this game, I think, but I don't know. When commentating, that's a completely different story. See if I can't get this guy. Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Ah, just barely. Oh no, here's somebody else. Here's somebody else. Oop, missed him. Ah, who died? You can see there's tombstones that drop when somebody dies. Ooh, somebody got him. This dude over here got him. Man, it's just a really interesting game. It's it runs smoothly. The only huge flaw I see is that nobody you can't make your own maps. You know how amazing this game would be if you could make your own maps and just you know anyone could play them. That's not an available thing right now, but I feel like that'd be really amazing. Somebody looked like they sniped the dupe out of me. So yeah, our current focus is to get as many kills as possible compared to the other team. Looks like we're doing pretty good. It's 16, 17, 14. Um, I'm not helping at all. Um, let's see, I don't have any points. So, I don't know. Maybe let's let's try to get some points here. And it's just so fun to be able to construct the map and make it work to your favor. There's there's a, um, there's um certain classes that will help you do that and that are more made for building than they are killing. And that helps for more strategical game modes, like Capture the Flag, or there's even a zombie game mode. And yeah, it's just a pretty fun game. Fun little game. Let's we'll see if I can. Oh jeez, he got me. Get some health. Get 
it over here. <laughs> yeah, I'm usually a lot better at this when I have my own peace and silence, but when commentating, I don't expect to be a perfect gamer. But I would not mind making more gameplay. Oh my gosh, there's a lot of great dudes over there. Look, there's one over here. I shot him, but didn't kill him. Oh, I got him. Nice. Because he has a little explosion animation when he dies. It's, I don't know, the animations and just the overall style of this game is actually quite hilarious. It's very playful, very, very just like childlike. Which I, I can't, I, I don't really mind it. Oh, I got him. Ooh, ooh, he really got me there. That was a headshot. One thing about these um game modes though is that they actually give you a very large amount of time. They give you about like 20 minutes to actually win and you know change the map to your liking. So it's not like it's some five minute game mode where oh you have to destroy everything as fast as you can. They actually give you time to form the map and make it work to your favor. See if I can't get that guy over there. Ooh, nice. Can I get him? Ah, oh, now he hid in the rocks. There is actually, for it being such a simple platform though, it has a lot of room for strategy in there. But I really feel like there just has to be like customizable maps, because I could see this being a very huge community-driven community, community -driven game if they have something like that. Let's see if I can't just sneak up on this dude. Oh, I missed. That's not good. Duck. Hopefully nobody saw me. Let's get this dude right here. I'm not doing that well. There we go. Oh jeez, oh jeez, he sees me. There you go, got him. Alright. <laughs> sort of hard to commentate and use a sniper rifle at the same time. I'm trying though, I'm trying. Probably should have picked a different class, but you know, who cares? One thing though is the, the, the maps are pretty well detailed. They look nice. They look like, I don't know, there's something with the lighting and the blocks. They, everything looks nice. The only thing I see that there's a problem with is the first person animations. There isn't much of them. You know, that could, you know, be changed. Especially since I know Jagex isn't really that poor of a company. They're not that indie. I know they can do a little better. I feel, I feel like they, um, if they put more money into this, put a little more focus, this could become a really good game. Like, this could become a pretty good title. But if they have to keep it at that $10 mark, I feel like they can't raise the price. Let's see if I can't get this guy. Oh no, oh no. You can also place mines like this when you're playing the sniper. And these are actually pretty hard to see. Sometimes I just walk right into them, and then I feel like the biggest doofus. Hmm, now I need to find my way back up. So are we winning? Yes, we're winning a lot. See if he doesn't just don't turn around, buddy. Yes. No, oh, I'm getting high on the. Oh, Jesus! Ah! Oh, no, 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 no! Get away! Get away! Get away from me! Get away! Oh man, this isn't good. See if I can't turn around. Get him. Where do you go? Where do you go? Oh. Ooh, he shot me. That was a good shot. Good on him. I think that guy was over here. Got to make sure there's not too many sniper rifles and snipers around, because then it's really hard to move around the map. So like, there's plenty of different variety of maps. There, there's maps like this that are very terrain-based, and then there's closer maps that are very much more close quarters. Ooh, that guy again? There he is. Maybe I should take the high ground next time. All right, then maybe I'll try a different. Different class. Let's try the um, Rocketeer. Now he's pretty cool. Um, you have to die to switch classes. <laughs> but um, now what he does is he has a jetpack, and you can just fly around. You have this cool little um, like machine gun, and this guy works out really well. These bombs here. These are not our team's bombs. It's very risky. So let's see if I can't um, find some dude and attack him. Ooh, and you can see there the blocks collapse if you knock something down. So we're still winning, that's good. Oh jeez. Oh, he got me. That was a good shot. Let's 
see if I can't get up there. I hear him, but I don't see him. Hmm. Where are you? So can't you hear him? That, that drives me nuts. I don't know where he is. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. Get the health, get the health. Where'd he go, where'd he go? Oh, did he just like kill himself? He did. Wow. Uh, I guess it's pretty smart. None of us got the kill. I don't think that gives us a point. That's actually really smart of him. And then this thing, you just like place this down and it'll attack anyone nearby. That's also very cool. And of course you can build terrain. How have I not talked about this? You can just build terrain. Maybe you're, you're in a tight spot, you can just build some protection. And of course you could break it too. <laughs> yeah. I guess that though it's not that much of an original game, but is that really that bad? I mean, I don't need originality if the game is fun to play, if you know what I'm saying. I, that's the bomb I placed earlier. Huh. Oh, there's somebody. Oh man. What did he have a rocket launcher? Jeez. That destroyed me. The other team's catching up now. This is not that good. No guts, no glory. Yeah, there is some voice acting in the game, not that much though. The game does have its own number of glitches, I'm surprised we haven't run into any of them yet. But, um, I know, like, one of the most common glitches is sometimes you'll spawn really high in the air where you died, and that's really weird because you're usually just gonna die again, and it sort of stinks. Unless you went in the water because it does follow Minecraft physics in that factor. Jumping is weird too, sometimes I feel like I'm pressing the space button, and it's just not jumping. Maybe that's just me though. Hmm, let's see if we can't find anyone. Looks like we got a bit more of a lead, too. Let's go around over here. We have six minutes left to destroy them. Let's see if we can't do anything really cool. I don't have that many kills anymore, do I? Uh, I only have five points. Ooh, here's some. Something I'm gonna... There we go. Ah, he's on my team. <laughs> no worries. Oh, here's somebody. Nice. There we go, now I'm catching back up in the points. Hopefully, slowly to a lead of points on our team. Look at these guys. Ooh, I'm gonna destroy them. Oh, no, I'm gonna miss horribly. Ah! Oh my gosh, that scared me. That really scared me. Yeah, I'll probably play as this class for the rest of the game. Let's see if I can't find those dudes again. Because I'd like to stop them from building into our base. Look at them, they're trying to d destroy this wall. And they just have to destroy all of this and all of that. And then they have it. It just, this thing will, this whole thing will collapse. Oh no, another rocket dude. Oh, he got me really good. Get, yeah, looks like he got a few headshots on me. I really like it though. It seems like whenever I play a game of Team Deathmatch, it's really close. Usually like, it's always like somebody wins by one or two kills. And I don't know if that's because of how, like the, the maps seem pretty balanced. Everything is symmetrical too. So it's really easy to find your way through things ever if you play the map once. Where are some green guys? I need to blow up some green guys. I really, if you if you enjoy something like Team Fortress 2, or Minecraft, or both, you know, <laughs> you should be able to really enjoy this game. I feel like there's obviously some things that TF2 and Minecraft have over this game. I feel like they're both still better games alone, but this game's still pretty good. Hmm. 
I also like this dragon over here. <laughs> I feel like we could have, I don't know, I'm just so surprised. Like, why can't we make our own maps in this game? Like, I can guarantee you, you'd see the coolest things ever if, like, I can make, you know, if anyone can make some maps in this game. Maybe I'd even try that, and I'm not that creative of a guy, I can tell you that. <laughs> Where was that dude? I saw somebody over here. There we go, got him. Oh jeez, I'm falling. Oh, there was somebody. Get him! Get him! Nice! Okay. Yeah, I, I get really competitive when I play games like this, so... It's really fun. <laughs> I thought this would be a nice little game to stream or something. Because it's like, it's very simple, easy to get the concept. You know, something fun, and if you guys get it, you can obviously... I, I think you guys can just join the server I'm on. I have really no idea if there's any type of queue system or anything. Oh jeez. There are a lot of snipers over there. I do not want to be... Situated with that. Hmm. Only have two minutes left. It looks like we have quite the lead. So. We should be A-OK -okay for the win. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, these guys do a lot of damage. Oh no, run away! Aww. Yeah, I'm not that good at the game. I'm decent, I guess. See if we can't find some more guys. Seems like it's really easy to pick out guys in this water. So I'm thinking I'm gonna just keep on doing that. Oh, there's somebody. Look at that, they destroyed the bridge. Do it. Ah, ah. Forget what that does. Whoa. Oh jeez, man. Come on. That was epic. <laughs> that was pretty epic. We just had like a complete showdown. Was somebody shooting at me. Where was that? I don't even know. One minute left. Are we winning? Barely. I cannot die. I cannot die. There's some guy over there. Oh no, he sees me. He sees me. Did I get him? No. Somebody else got him, but hey. Oh no! Are we gonna win? I don't know. It's gonna be really close. We have 30 seconds left. I might just wanna not kill anyone. We just try to kill anyone and just maintain the lead by doing that, by not dying. Hmm. Yeah, looks like we're gonna win. That's awesome. Actually, we we might not win. Oh no, it's getting really close. Oh, it looks like we won. Awesome. I'll put GG to be a good sport. Oh, okay. It didn't let me. <laughs> well. That was Ace of Spades, made by Jagex. I hope you guys liked this video. If you did, um, thank you for you know watching it and enjoying it. Um, I'll see you guys later. This, like I said, this was Ace of Spades. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys later.